Standing on the patio of La Valerie's restaurant, you get a great sense of what makes this tiny gem sparkle. Millions of meals have been served under these twinkling trees. Countless conversations and celebrations have taken place. History has been made here more than once. And somehow, you could feel those roots when you dine here. Throw another log on. We're taking you back to 1924, when this historic landmark was first built. It was the home of George B. Roberson, a man who, along with his mother, Nellie Kaufman, owned and operated the It Hotel of the time, the Desert Inn. Historians say it was that very hotel that forever changed and shaped the desert landscape. The Roberson House sat across the street from the Desert Inn and saw its share of grand parties and significant guests. The hotel was eventually demoed in the late 60s, and in the early 70s, the Roberson House was sold. The new owners, Paul Brueggemann's and his partner, successful restaurateurs in Hollywood. It was their movie studio patrons who urged them to open a restaurant in Palm Springs. Great care was taken to transform the Spanish Revival three-bedroom home into a restaurant. In 1973, La Valerice opened its doors and set the service standards that would stand the test of time. Consistency is the key word to our business. That means not much has changed through the years, especially with the French Mediterranean cuisine. When you came here 10 years ago and you come back today, you remember that you have had something that you really liked. You can get it back exactly the same it was 10 years ago. Something that has changed the ficus trees in the patio. Brueggemann's planted them in the 70s, and my, how they have grown. Everybody wants to sit outside. Everybody that has ever gone to southern France will say, this is the spirit, the feeling of southern France. La Valerie's is named after a city in southern France known for pottery painting. The art form here is something much different. What is the heart of this restaurant? The chef, I would say, the chef and my brother, uh, they are, it's a two-hearted place. <laughs> chef Jean-Paul has been at the helm of the kitchen for more than 30 years. Bruce, the sommelier, has been pouring here that long too. And Patrice, the maitre d', he's been greeting guests since 1979. Not a night goes by that one of the Brueggemann's brothers doesn't visit every table and chat with every guest. He expects nothing but perfection. He's a very hard taskmaster, even with his brother, I can assure you. La Valerie's remains one of the highest rated restaurants in Greater Palm Springs. Word of mouth has served them well. We are happy, we are happy to still be the toast of the town. Just knowing that we survived this long, I think that's, uh, that's quite a feat. Yes. Now we toast. Now we toast. Now we, toast. <laughs> now we need a drink. <laughs> the toast of to the town. To the colorful past, to the ever present, and to a bright future. Thank you so much for watching Wanderlust. Don't forget to like and subscribe to see where we wander next.